this video we're going to talk about how you can wire transfer on the Bank of America app. Now the first step is going to be logging into the mobile banking app and we will need to have gathered the recipient's information such as the recipient's name and address, their wire routing number, their bank account number as well as their account type. And if you have not enrolled in the secure transfer you also need your debit card number and PIN. That was the first step. Now for the second step, we will have to click on pay and transfer, which should be located right here at the bottom, should be the second option. The third step, we will have to click on wire. Again, it is highlighted in this picture. And for the fourth step, we will have, if you have both banking and investing accounts, we will need to select the account you want to send the wire transfer from. So like it is shown right here, you just have to select the account which we want to use the money from. And the fifth step is going to be tapping on start a wire to initiate the wire transfer. And we can click on more next to the light bulb to see what you need to send the wire transfer. So this is it. So we'll have to click on start a wire. The sixth step, if you're sending money to a recipient for the first time, you'll need to add your account. So we'll need to click on add new recipient as shown right here. And if you're sending to an existing recipient, we will need to select our recipient here and we can directly proceed to step 13. Okay, so step 13 here, now that you have your domestic recipient uh, has been added, we can choose an account to select the account from which you want to transfer money. So again, we'll have to choose the account by clicking on choose account here. Select your wire from account for the transfer. So here you can see the both of the accounts. So we have to highlight the one that we want to use and click on next. We'll have to type the amount and then uh, you want to send and then click on next. Now scroll down to review the total cost for the wire transfer, including the wire free, wire fee, sorry, add additional notes for the recipient's bank if desired. And we can click on next. If you haven't already, you may be required to enroll into secure transfer to send your wire. You will need a US phone number and we'll click on next here. If you haven't already enrolled, you receive a text message with an authorization code to complete enrollment. Enter your authorization code, then add your ATM slash debit card details. And we'll have to tap on add number to complete the enrollment. You will receive confirmation that your mobile number is enrolled and then we can tap on continue to proceed with our domestic wire transfer. So just click on continue. Before sending the wire transfer, review all the details. Be sure to expand the fields, confirm all details, tap the edit button if you need to modify any details here. And after that, we can authorize the payment and just click on uh, send. You will see a confirmation that your wire transfer have, has been submitted. Tap share to save and share a, a receipt. Tap done to exit the wire screen and you will receive email confirmation. So it's going to look like this if we have successfully sent the wire transfer. Domestic wire transfers are typically received the same business day if sent before 5 p.m. ET. Your wire transfer will appear in the activity screen where you can view status and details. And that's basically how you do it. I hope this was informative. Leave a like and sub. I'll see you next time.